and I am Dr. Oswal and uh, I am the found I and my daughter Dr. Pooja we are the founders of G therapy uh, inventors of G therapy in um, various national international conferences where I have presented my work uh, for G therapy uh, I was asked a question how come the G therapy is useful for so many varied various types of neurological disorders like autism, cerebral palsy, developmental disabilities, neurodegenerative disorders, how come the same medicine is useful? So that question was asked to me in 1996 in, in an international conference. I presented in various about 13 national international conferences my work about G-therapy. And then for two th or three years I was researching and then I made a hypothesis in 1999. In 1999, I made a hypothesis and in this book, Mind Body G, I postulated a hypothesis that there must be a supreme control in the brain, which when reactivated or stimulated can bring about the functional improvements in various types of brain disorders. So this is the book where in 1999, I presented this and this is a hypothesis which made on the 2000 cases of neurodevelopmental disorders, cerebral palsy, autism, various types of degenerative brain disorders, I made a hypothesis. I will read this with a huge data of more than 2000 cases of developmental disabilities of different etiopathologies and 70% of them responding to G-therapy. I imagine with my very little knowledge in neurology, if there is any dormant supreme control in the brain which when simulated can initiate recovery because many cases of irreversible brain damage have shown perceptible improvements with G-therapy. These are my observations and not claims. For further visit, you can visit my internet uh, website www.g-therapy.org. So this was a hypothesis which was made in May 1999 and this booklet was published and distributed to various parts of the uh, world. Recently after 14 years, the Canadian scientists and the scientists from European uh, research brain organization, they have found a dormant supreme control gene. They have found out and that is also in animals. But this same hypothesis was made by me 14, 15 years before that there is a dormant supreme control in the brain with a documentation of 2000 cases. Thank you.